with the speed of light, a cloud of dust, and the hot Ohio silver, the Lone Ranger. <laughs> Companion Toto, the daring and resourceful masked rider of the plains, led the fight for law and order in the early western United States. Nowhere in the pages of history can one find a greater champion of justice. Return with us now to those thrilling days of yesteryear. From out of the past come the thundering hoofbeats of the great horse Silver. The Lone Ranger rides again. Dan rode on 
only a short distance when he saw a buckboard coming toward him. As he was about to pass, the man driving the vehicle called out. Hey, wait a minute. Who, who, Mr. Hoboy? Uh, who, who, who? Howdy, son. My name is Jason Sergio B. It's my wife. I'm glad to meet you. Hello. My name's Dan Ray. Uh, Dan Ray? I bet I am that stallion as you rode towards us. I'd sure like to buy him. I'm sorry, Mr. Bates. He's not for sale. I'll give you a good price, sir. <laughs> I couldn't put a price on Victor, sir. He said he didn't want to sell, didn't he? Why do you waste time sitting here talking when he... Lane says, look, coming over the rise to the left. Left out, Lord. The leader's wearing a hood. Why, if I wouldn't. Right, we're going, Dan. Wait, wait, wait. We haven't a chance. Don't talk. Hey, we got your cover. Boss is signaling for him to get off the bud board. Come on, you two step down. Better do as he says. Who's lying? He never. Get covered, men. Licking our virgin. Said he was bought. You just smart, too, young fella. Victor, all right. Now take your gun, young fella, and yours, mister. Now throw him over yonder. Here's the cash the rancher was carrying. Shall I fix the woman, too? Let her alone, Jake. The boss just signaled and let her be. What's that silly signaling business? First man I ever met who didn't want to let himself be heard all over the place. Let me tell you, Mr. Hooded Man, you'll be sorry for this. The day will come when you and your Stephen followers will rue the day you ever Get up, will Come on, Slick. The boss wants to get away from this yapping female. Right? He told me to stop. Sounds like money, and it is. Matter of fact, I've got a handful of genuine foreign coins, 
real money you could spend right now in faraway lands. And here's the best part. All you Wheaties fans can have this wonderful collection of foreign coins for your very own. Just listen. Wheaties is offering two different sets of foreign coins, 15 coins in each set. The international set has coins from countries like Finland and Pakistan. The mystery set has coins from places like Monaco and southern Rhodesia. Each set comes in a special coin folder with a map that shows you where the coins are used and information about that country. And each coin has been cleaned and polished. How do you get these genuine foreign coins? Well, for each set, you send us only one Wheaties box stop and 25 cents. Look for the directions on the back of Wheaties special foreign coin packages now at your grocer's. Pick one up and start collecting foreign coins. Well, 
with his hands tied behind him. What's the idea? You not need gun. Need bring note. Here. Note. My going, Jim. You won't kill. You gun. Let's see what this is all about. Across Baker coming through from California coal fields, paid me in 
go to the corner. I had locked again the scales and ducked some of the dust on the sleeve. Don't know where it can. They got the dust on his sleeve. Oh, wait a minute. Another of the outlaws had some of the gold-covered dust on his clothing. Perhaps someplace near the gang's hideout. Hideout? That does it. I recollect now. A couple of months ago, a prospector who dug for a long time thought he struck it rich. When he dug a regular cave into a hill, he found out it was only fool's gold. And then in a rage, he went back and threw the dust all over the place. Well, I don't know about that. must use that cave for a hideout. That explains the flecks of gold on Canby's sleeve and on the other outlaw's clothing. Jiminy, right. you must be right. We'll help you round up the rest of the gang, Cuz. Mister, you've done your part in grabbing the most important one, the quiet highwayman. We'll put him in jail. And I'll take a big posse and grab the others without any trouble at all. <laughs> they won't be expecting us, so it'll be easy. Well, we'll be chatting nearby until we hear they capture Cuz. We'll see you again. Let's go, Cotto, then. Right. Adios. Adios. Here, tell me one thing. What made you change to sudden like after you read that note? Who is that masked man? Well, <laughs> you know, I wondered why he didn't gun us earlier when he finally got the drop on us at the Grove. But now, I know the answer to that one. You see, he's none other than the Lone Ranger. Fighting Lone Ranger adventure, Race for Life. Now, free stamp offer from Cheerios, the ready to eat oat cereal. A 64 page guide packed with information on stamp collecting, plus 10 genuine foreign stamps to start your collection. Free with one special Cheerios fast stop. You want this handy 1955 guide. It contains many pages in full color, gives you tips on how to collect stamps. How to start your own stamp club and include the whole section on U.S. stamps. Get both guide and ten genuine foreign stamps free for only one special Cheerios box top. And on the back of the same Cheerios package, find still another offer. 300 foreign stamps plus stamp album for only 25 cents and box top. All stamps supplied by the world's largest stamp firm, H.E. Harrison Company of Boston. Act now. Look for the Cheerios package with the free stamp offer on the front. went on the warpath and threatened the town and territory around Viewpoint, the Lone Ranger risked his life to bring help and to create a better understanding among the settlers. Action and suspense make this an adventure you'll not want to miss. Be sure to listen. The Lone Ranger, a copyrighted feature of the Lone Ranger Incorporated, is created by George W. Trendle. Produced by Trendle Campbell Muir Incorporated, directed by Charles D. Livingston, and edited by Fran Stryker. The part of the Lone Ranger is played by Brace Beamer. Your announcer, Fred Foy. The Lone Ranger is brought to you by General Mills every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at this same time. Be sure to listen. This recorded program has come to you from Detroit. This is ABC Radio Network.